Round two, Thursday night footy gets underway. The Bulldogs and Carlton at Marvel. And look at that, it's Cripp straight away to Walsh, to Fisher. Hands off, Hewitt. Now O'Brien will want to get back onto his left boot. Goes with the right, inside 50. First opportunity, Kerno gathers, snaps. Oh, what a start! Up to the task, into the middle. The one-on-one. -on -one. Caleb Daniel happy to take it. This kick better than his last onto the chest of English. Not as he would have liked. Throughout his entire career, really. Drives to 50. Again, it's English at the front. Did he get enough? Umpire said yes. This is Pittenet to defend. So English makes better contact than his first. It's working its way back. Goal apiece on Thursday night footy. Putting Big Pitnet under under pressure, forcing him to defend, and he certainly learnt from his last shot. He's absolutely drilled that one from 50, and uh, that's a terrific start for him. Wants to go quickly onto his right. That's a bullet to Rourke Smith, who runs to 55, draws an opponent, hands it off. Vandermeer, Eugle Hagen from the angle, works it back superbly. Kick was able to get there quickly and there was space over in the overlap and the fantastic snap and just a player only in his second year. Hunter took it in the air. McGovern took him before he hit the ground. Handball in front of Whiteman. Here's a chance for the dogs. Handball inside coming up. It'll work out. Trelaw might take a bounce. Breaks the arc. Runs to 40. Now to 30. All about the finish and the finish is good. govern and then follow up and we have a look at that sidestep that you talked about but burst forward and created that space and opportunity for Trelaw but it was this contest on the halfback flank where he brought the ball to ground to short ball English kick the first for the dogs off to McRae that unique kicking style unbelievable Scott flies from the side I thought it was a brilliant build-up build from the Dogs. I loved taking what was on offer and forcing Carlton's sort of defensive structure to, to defend, the, defend the man. And ultimately, the final kick inside 50 was an absolute laser. Great courage there. Amazing. Drop for the grand final. Watched last week. Back in this week. Puts it through. Well done, Anthony Scott. Dogs with one more chance. Trelaw. Can they find a mark inside 50? They're going to get a free kick instead. That was always headed for the post, wasn't it? What a first quarter of football. Is deep ball forward, almost for Scott, not quite. Under pressure, the Blues. Liberatore, clean pickup. Little give wasn't so clean. Jamari Ugohagen up under long sail. Across the face in the end. Having surgery for stage three cancer in 2020. Chemo for 12 weeks last year and back out again. Yeah, we speak at half time as Caleb Daniel hopes for the long ball. In stoppage, they use their slick handball to find someone in space and they send it into a dangerous area which puts Carlton defenders under pressure and we see Norton get a free kick. The entry hit the post after the quarter time siren. This. Much better gets the first of his night. Dogs needed it. Ooh, maybe a little bit stiff there. You know, the umpire's obviously got the arm around. You know, whether or not it's there, I think the most important thing for the Dogs players and the Dogs supporters is that he goes back and takes the opportunity. I think uh, the show replay might see the same. Dale streams from behind from 52. Low trajectory kick. Well done, McDonald. On the Blues kicked 11 goals in the first half as 2014. Still eight minutes to play. Dogs a chance here. Ball to ground level. Liberatore terrific. Picked it up. Brings it back. All the way back. Quick, brilliant response. Gifts in momentum in games. And clearly, we've mentioned it all night. For the Dogs to get back into the game, they're going to have to win their fair share in there. And that's a terrific start and a brilliant finish from Liber. Fantastic. Football set of field. Coughs it up. Did Walsh to Bontempelli. Inside 50. Eugle Hagen wants to turn. Has got an option. It's Hannon. Couldn't find him. And the Blues may escape. Durden. 
McDonald, and they hang on through William on the chest. Charlie delivers towards 50. Keith in best position at the front, picks it off. Inside 50. His kick, the pack forms, and Hannon flies! An absolute gem. Flew up, second bite needed. Now the goal required. To follow the ball to the ground, wasn't it? He got the perfect ride. And then being able to make sure he secured it. Great mark. Important goal. Terrific elevation and an important goal just before half time. Now Saad. And that was a scintillating half of football.